Warner Brothers commented on the stat of my favorite hospital show of all time. Since I was like seven, I really didn't watch it. Oh, you're a big ER fan? Oh, yeah. When I, I didn't know that. How come we've never I talked about that? Talk I'm so night, obsessive. I stay up. My mom would be sleeping. I'd be up there like, oh, my God. What's gonna I'm so obsessed with ER. I didn't know that. I've been watching it since season one. I'm so sad that it's going away. I haven't been able to watch it recently, but when I was a kid, oh, my God. I'm now that so sad. Back, I'm so sad, and, and they've had they've had everybody come back this year so far. Anthony Edwards came back, even though he died, but they had him come back in a flashback. They had um, Paul McCrane come back; he played Romano. They had uh, Alex Kingston come back. Yeah, so Will, um, William William Macy's coming back this Thursday. Really? Yeah, who played Morgan Stern? And 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 Eric LaSalle showed up to say we love you and miss you, Michael Crichton, when he died. And do the fist pump? He doesn't no, he didn't. Nope. But he but he looked terrible. Really? He looked terrible, Eric LaSalle. But go ahead. Anyway, um, rumors have it that he was wearing a wedding band on set. I'm so, just videotaping the news. Okay. Go ahead. So, he was wearing a wedding band on set. So oh! It might, you know, that's the storyline. No one's commented, though, so we'll have to uh, wait and see what happens. Wow. So, okay. Yeah. Spoiler alert. My, yeah. I know. Dun, dun, dun. Anyway, uh, Lindsay Lohan paying tribute to Heath Ledger. Sources told People, the Mean Girl star, was who was co-hosting a party in Connecticut with girlfriend Samantha Ronson, Threw extra party invites into the crown, uh, into the crown. I'm sorry, which read "Rest in peace, peace, Heath Ledger." With all my love, Lindsay Lohan. I don't see what the big deal was about Heath Ledger. We got into this the last he time. Was, I mean, he's an amazing actor. He's yeah, amazing. he was great. He did coke with the Olsen twins, Scott. Anyway, this was exactly a year after the award-winning Joker was found dead in his apartment. Desk. See, so it was like <laughs> a year anniversary too. I didn't know they were very close, and I didn't know the Olsens were were close. Yeah, did you? Did you know? It was so funny. And then when she was linked to the. This past week, the Olsen twins were on Oprah, and of course, the Oprah did not ask the famous question about the Heath Ledger. Now, we stood away from that, you know, because they're rich like me, so I can't ask that. I don't like Oprah anyway. <laughs> Go ahead. <I> that. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> Last time. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know I'm not an Oprah fan. Go ahead. Okay, and if John Travolta <laughs> hadn't been through enough, the paramedic who tried to revive his Oh, body here we go. And charged for conspiracy to extort and attempting to extort, extort, oh my God, $25 million from the family reports, People Magazine. Not, not for nothing, I've had it with John Travolta too. He should have been the one that left us and not his son. And, they, and John Travolta should be the one that sued for denying the fact that his child wasn't autistic. Because you know what, there was something wrong with that child. I don't care what anybody says. Liars. <laughs> Scumbag. But, but he knew there was going to come up with somebody's going to have a photo, somebody's going to yeah. have like, like ashes or something. To, he was trying to sell the me medical documents to the media. You knew that was coming. Yeah, but mm. I mean, you're a paramedic. Like, there's so many things that people could sell, you know what I mean? Like That kid's better off not having John Travolta and his wife oh in his life. Oh, God. Oh, my oh, God. Please. I mean, give me a break. They, 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 you just see that kid? That kid was definitely handicapped. There's definitely issues going on that he completely denied because he's a Scientologist and they don't believe in that. That's true, yeah. You know what? They should hook him up to the clay table and kick his ass. Go ahead, Carrie. Nice. Yeah, I figured <laughs> I figure Dan's not here. Somebody's got to take his place. Know, right? He's like, right. <laughs> no, that bothers me. I'm sorry. You know how I feel about Orca and about John Travolta. I just don't like either one of them. Go ahead. All right, well, Kelly Osborne's back in rehab. rehab. <laughs> I love her. I speak today. Anyway, after a visit in 2004 for painkiller abuse, the rock star's rep stated that Kelly has voluntarily readmitted herself in order to deal with some personal issues. Sharon states that the family is standing behind her. That's good. I like the Osbournes. The Osbournes were fun when they had their show on A&E. You know what? That's, that's so, they are funny. But, oh, my God, poor Ozzy. He's like, Rex. Anyway.